Hey YouTube, what's up? This is JR, and uh, back again with part two of uh, my unboxing and installation. So uh, here we go. Okay, so as I was saying yesterday, um, there's there aren't going to be any, any instructions in the box. They come PDF. So either you're going to have to go to the website or really install the hard drive, plug in the hard drive for you to see the PDF of the instructions for uh, uh, Complete Ultimate 9. So, uh, and, I, and I found out a couple of little extra tidbits that I didn't know yesterday when I first bought the unit, or when I or day before yesterday when I first got the unit, um, that uh, I'll let you know toward the end of this video. So uh, let's go through it. Okay, first thing you want to do is uh, plug in the hard drive and you want to plug it in the mini USB you want to plug the cord into the mini USB first then you're going to plug after you plug the mini USB in you're going to plug the two USB inside of two of your regular USB ports because it's going to need both of those or the or this hard drive or your computer won't recognize this hard drive. So if you just try to plug one of these in, it won't recognize. So you need both of these to be plugged in into both USB ports. Then this will fire up because there's a little light on here and you'll see it light up. So once you plug those in, it'll fire up and you'll see the light. So considering I'm doing this with an iPad, I'm going to pause, plug everything in, show you what I'm talking about, and then we're going to keep it moving from there. Okay, like I said, uh, you have to plug both of these uh, USB, the regular two USBs in. So if you have two extra ports in the front of your computer, that's what you do. You plug one in right next to the other or wherever you have. I have four slots in the front of this one. So um, I just plugged them in side by side. And then once you plug it in, your complete will light up, letting you know that uh, the, art, the hard drive is on and everything is plugged in correctly and it's now you're ready to install and that's about it so let me so I'm about to show you the what it looks like on the screen okay so once you plug in the hard drive at least on a PC it should pop up like this so you should get all of these files that pretty much I don't know if you can see it is coming in blurry but these are all of the files that come in there inside the hard drive I know this is kind of blurry y'all so forgive me for this I don't know if I can get it clear uh, but trust me it's gonna pop up I know on the PC it does because I'm using a PC so um, all of, all of your files are just going to pop up on the screen like that and then what you're going to do is you're going to scroll all the way to the bottom and then you'll see the installation application right there and you click that and you're off and running now this is where it gets a little interesting because if you have a separate hard drive and you don't know how to do it, uh, Native Instruments, uh, they do have instructions for you to go in there and uh, uh, tell you how to, to, to put it on another hard drive. So I'm just going to guide you to that real quick. I'm not going to go through the whole thing. So I'm just going to guide you to that. So I'm going to close the screen. And now we're on the Native Instruments website here. I already pulled it up. So that way I don't have to waste time with it. So what you're going to do is you're going to go to the Native Instruments website, go to support, and then when you're on support, you're going to go to online help, click that right there, and then when you get to, when you get to knowledge base, you're going to go in there and click, and click right there. And then when you're in knowledge base, you're going to come over here to recent entries. And then you're going to go to going to read where it says complete ultimate nine. 
and then it's going to pretty much give you all the information that you need uh, for it so and then they have how to install product bundle windows um, they have one for Mac right here another one for Windows so they, they, they you know they pretty much take care of you to make sure that you can get it installed I had to call yesterday I think it was and and asked the guy and he he was nice enough to show me where everything was so uh, and then that's about it uh, and then once you follow those instructions you'll be able to install it on the hard drive if this is your first installation like was for mine I thought I was gonna be able to get it done and then make another video right after but it took three hours to get all that information from uh, from um, off the um, hard disk drive um, onto my computer so um, it's gonna take a minute so might as well just go grab a Starbucks or something because it's gonna it's gonna it's gonna be a minute it ain't gonna it, this ain't gonna be like a five minute install this is this is a for real deal install so uh, take your time no rush if you have a session that day you might as well cancel it because um, it's gonna take about three hours or get up early in the morning and get it done so anyway and uh, just to let you know, I'm now I'm working on a, a reasonably fast computer. I mean, I got an i7, and um, I got 12 gigs of RAM on here, working off of Windows 7 Ultimate. So um, uh, it's actually pretty. You know, I have a pretty, I have a fairly decent computer over here. And then once you get it all installed, then you're gonna. Then it's going to give you your updates. So these are all the updates right here that you're going to get once you get all your all your uh, uh, instruments and stuff downloaded. Then it's going to ask you, do you want to do the updates? Of course, you're going to want to do them. And then, uh, and then that's it. I mean, then everything is pretty much, you know, on your computer. Now, let me say this before I end this video: is that um, uh, your classic uh, reverb, your your reverb 24 and your reverb uh, 48, that's going to come later because they didn't put it on the disc. I got an email 48 hours later because I didn't even realize it wasn't even on on you know inside of the on the hard disk or anything because I haven't really played with it yet. So um, uh, yeah, they they sent me like 48 hours later an email saying, oh, we didn't put those on there, and they sent me a download, um, sent me a link to the download, and uh, to download those two uh, reverbs, classic reverbs, and also it's going to take about 48 hours for you to get your $25 voucher. So if this is the first time for you. That's what you can expect anywhere from 24 to 48 hours. Um, at least that's what it was for me. And uh, that's about it, y'all. So good luck. Uh, enjoy yourself. Hope everybody makes good music. Looking to hear, looking to hear from y'all. Um, I'll have something out pretty soon. Just trying to dot my I's, cross my T's before anything gets out there. So and uh, that's about it. You guys have a good day. Peace.